Twitter has shattered. It has exploded. It has erupted. Tim Tebow is siding with the Philadelphia Eagles on Monday. Yeah. Yeah. Tebow, baby. Tebow. 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 <laughs> uh, but seriously, um, you know, honestly, besides the media circus that this signing is about to bring, it's really not that big of a deal. He's a third string quarterback. It's really not a big deal at all. I mean, I, I see a lot of people freaking out right now. And, you know, we, we do know that Chip Kelly loves his Oregon Ducks. Um, unfortunately, he didn't go to Oregon, but um, there's no one that can throw a better duck than Tim Tebow. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, I mean, he's a third-string quarterback. This really isn't that big of a deal. Um, now, there are actually some positives to take away from this because we, we all know that, you know, how he is in the locker room and, and all that good stuff and, you know, how, how he's a he's all for the team and all that. But, um, you know, the thing that I'm hoping that Chip Kelly can do is convince him to play something other than quarterback. I'm hoping that he can, you know, play a little bit of tight end, a little bit of that halfback role that James Casey played. You know, James Casey not on the team anymore. Um, you know, because when Tim Tebow does have the ball in his hands – he can pick up yards, and I'm hoping that, you know, they can convince him to do that um, because, you know, as a quarterback, he's he's not going to see the field, okay? He's a third stringer. I mean, Matt Barkley, I don't even think – did he really even take a snap last year? So, um, you know, in terms of the, the media buzz and all that, yeah, you know, it, it's going to be hectic, especially during training camp. I mean, I can already, these preseason games are going to be insane, you know, all the Tebow love in the, in the second half. But, um, you know, all in all, again, it's not a big deal. He's a third-string quarterback. We don't need to get our panties up in a bunch, okay? Um, he's now on the team. He's on the roster. And who knows? He might not even make the team, all right? I mean, uh, but I will say this. I would take Tim Tebow over Matt Barkley any day of the week, okay? Matt Barkley stinks. He's terrible. At least Tebow has won a goddamn playoff game, okay? All right, so, you know, I, I might take heat for this video. I don't know. You know, I, I feel like I like the signing a lot more than other people do. Um, again, I'm going to stress this again. He's a third-string quarterback. It's, it's not like we're signing him as a backup. It's not like we're signing him to be even the, the starter or anything. He's a third-string quarterback, okay? And if we can utilize him in some halfback sets, in some tight end sets... You, you know, we all know that Chip Kelly loves to implement three tight end sets. He hasn't really done it so far in Philadelphia yet, but maybe with Tim Tebow, he will. That's that's kind of what I'm thinking with this signing. I'm not thinking quarterback as much as to get him on the field, you know, in other areas. Maybe you take maybe he does take some wildcat snaps. I don't know. But, you know, Chip Kelly's got a creative mind. He has a plan in place for him. He's, he's now on the roster. So let's see how they utilize him. You know, um, obviously we're not going to know how to utilize them until, you know, training camp starts. Um, but, you know, I'm curious to see if they can convince him to take some snaps at a position other than quarterback. I mean, sure, he'll be listed as a quarterback, but is, is he actually going to play quarterback? I don't know. We'll find out soon. Tebow, 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 Tebow. <laughs> I'm out of here.